Hi guys, I'm Shmi and today I'm at a military barracks with Nissan for what looks set to be a pretty mental day. It's boiling here in the UK, it's about 33 degrees right now, but we're out at this military barracks with a lot of space to play with. We've got the model year 2017 at Nissan GTR just down there, but the main reason I am here is for a couple of other things. Firstly, we've got the 370Z drift car with the GT Academy, and I'm gonna get an opportunity to take that thing sideways. First time I've done anything like that, so that's gonna be pretty mega. Next up is gonna be this, the Nissan GTR Pro Drift car 1390 horsepower that holds the world record for the fastest drift that thing went sideways at over 300 kilometers per hour and i'm going to get a hot lap passenger ride in that later on and then finally to wrap it all up we're going to be going up on two wheels in the duke that's just over that away so this is going to be pretty mega only downside is that being so hot i do have to wear a race suit so i'm going to be sweltering but I think this is one I'm not going to forget. So let me go downstairs, get set up, signed on, and work out what's going to be happening next. I'm all suited up, sweltering away in the sunshine, but I've got my race suit, my shoes. I've also got an open face helmet that I'm going to be wearing today from Sparco. But any excuse to wear my custom race gear, of course, today is pretty much perfect for that. But let's take a look at this, the 17 GTR, a car that I got familiar with at the Goodwood Festival of Speed a couple of weeks ago. I was taken up the hill climb for a run with Jan Mardenborough, Jan the man. And let's just say um, it was fairly bonkers. It was very, very quick. The man knows how to drive these things. So hopefully I'm going to be filming one of these in the not too distant future. Um, got some plans on an upcoming trip. But let me go and have a look at the car I'm going to be driving first. At the moment, I'm a little bit of a novice. I don't really know what I'm in store for, but this is going to be a learning game. I'm going to be shown how to do this and given a sort of introduction to drifting a car in this beast, the 370Z, run by the GT Academy. So the car is obviously completely set up for this purpose. I think it's probably open. Let's take a look at the inside so you can see what I'm going to be driving. Full carbon panels on the doors, obviously full roll cage, massive hardcore race seat, um, even all the way up to the uh, support up there for the helmet. But this is what we're going to be driving. Not that many controls in here. And um, yeah, I think I'm just going to be thrown in the hot seat. We're going to see how that goes. But I can't imagine it's going to be anything but awesome fun, except it would help if I could close the door. It's going to be just ridiculous, I suspect. So I'm going to find somebody to take me out. And then I'm going to experience what this is about. OK, then. <laughs> so first thing first, let's get the engine turned on so we can turn the air conditioner off. <laughs> Uh, do I need to do anything? Just clutch them. Yeah, that's it. Oh, on this. It has some life. That's it. Okay then, we're in. I'm with Joff. Can you show me what to do? <laughs> yeah. Are you ready to go? I think so. Right. What do I need to know? Just regular manual gearbox? Yeah, six-speed manual gearbox. So uh, we only need second gear basically. So. Um, yeah, we don't need to do loads of gear changes or anything. Mm -hmm. Also, you notice we don't have a handbrake. I did notice that. So, yeah, there's none of that drifter, drifter okay. style handbraking. <laughs> um, we'll just be doing it purely off of uh, a lack of a lack of grip off our slightly narrow rear tyres and obviously 320 brake horsepower. So, um, okay, that, that should be enough to, to get the car to rotate. <laughs> it sounds fun. Mega, you ready to go? Yes, I am. You, what you'll probably need to do is be slightly aggressive on turning just throw it in a little bit and then power there you go okay. Straight for a figure of eight, if that's okay. No, that's cool. <laughs> it's strange, the technical stuff. <laughs> it felt quite easy, like natural, and quite straight away to get a sort of a feel of it. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh well. Good work. No, no, you're doing well. 
like I say, if you don't, you do, if you don't spin, you don't find out where the true uh, yeah, yeah. limits are. So, round two. <laughs> round two, same again. Oh, goodness. That was really cool. I like this car. It's a smoker, isn't it? A bit smoky now, though. Yeah, it's just... We're having a quick ice cream break before I go out on the GTR, but that is an opportunity to come and look at this thing, the tyre that I destroyed. That has completely um, gone. The inside of the tyre, that's what happens when you drift. Completely tread. Goodbye. Right, well, I'm going to finish the ice cream which hopefully isn't going to be too much to eat before I go out in this mega, mega thing. Um, so at the Goodwood Festival of Speed, we filmed with this car. I sat in it, fired it up. Um, but now I'm going to get shown how it slides. And this is probably going to be quite, quite crazy. And I think I might even have an opportunity to just drive it and see what one, one and a half thousand nearly horsepower feels like. But exciting times ahead. I should probably tell you guys that we're with Darren and he um, he knows what's up in this thing. <laughs> yeah. And we'll be the man showing us what's going on today. He actually showed me around the car at Goodwood. So, I'm looking forward to this. I'm getting used to the camera. Sorry? I said I'm after getting used to it. Yeah. <laughs> Which is a good thing for you. Alright, let's make a move.
my friend. <laughs> Utterly ridiculous. The amount of smoke inside there was crazy too, but as an experience, my word. Like I was just saying, it, that just took me into hysterics, and I get to do quite a lot of this cool stuff for Shmi150 videos, but that, my word. Car's just gone over now to be sorted out, ready for the next run, but it's such a like delicate balance, yet it's so controllable, and I mean, we were just flying by, I don't know what speed, but over 100 miles an hour. I'm very sideways. Oh boy, oh boy. And that's not even the end of my day, but I just need to take a moment to, to take it in. Got more 370Z action going on over there. And now we need to go and find the two-wheeler, because we're going to be going up, literally, on two wheels. Next up, it's time to go on two wheels in the Duke. So Terry Grant's at the wheel. We're going to jump in, and uh, this is going to be interesting. Hello. How are you doing? I'm right. very good, thank good. you. I'm looking forward to this. Tim, how's it going? Hi, Tim. Yeah, all good, thank you. Cool. Okay. I'll try not to kill you, but I can't guarantee it. Oh, thanks. We'll try. That's, that's what I've signed my life away yeah. for. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know that disclaimer thing that you sign? Yeah. Never have you needed that any more than you have now. So it's, as you can see, it's quite a good angle, <laughs> and we've got no safety bars on, or no, this is just us. This is really... <laughs> and we're kind of doing it the hard way. As you can see, it's a left-hand drive car, and I'm up in the air, where normally 
I'd be down the low side. That's more comfortable for me, but this is what we've got, <laughs> so this is what we're digging with today. Okay then. <laughs> the angle is... This is utterly ridiculous. The angle of the car is amazing, isn't it? It's, oh, I'm sat like completely sideways. <laughs> Goodness me. It's really, if you see my hand movement, you'll see, even though we're going in a straight line, we're not, we can't relax. It either wants to fall on its roof or it wants to fall on its tires all the time. Okay. So that's kind of. That's a drive on two wheels. <laughs> <laughs> that's the reaction we hope for. Just the face. It's just of, the most insane thing ever, isn't it? It's just, yeah, just it's smile. Not natural, is it? Yeah. Completely unnatural. Like, I wasn't expecting to be so angled. It is so angled. It, it's really the point of balance is right up there. It's not. It's not low. It, which yeah, it's now it's beyond forty-five. It's way beyond. Yeah. It's way beyond. We're trying to fall over all the time. Wow. And just preventing us from falling over. Awesome. It's Thank mega, you very much. It? There's some massive Brilliant. smile. That's what we like to see. <laughs> well, of course. That tops off a mega, mega day. Getting to drift in that thing, it just felt so cool, so controllable, and I definitely, definitely want to be doing more of that. Then going out and doing the high-speed flyby in the GTR. I mean, well, you saw it on my face, just the giggles of hysteria of that experience before we went up on two wheels with Terry there. So, yeah, not bad one today with Nissan and the GT Academy and Pro Drift, and oh my God, wow. I, yeah. Just a bit lost for words. If you want to see more of this car, do check out the other video I did with it. But it has now got rather windy, even though it is very, very sunny out here today. Um, yeah, I'm just a little bit lost for words in the overall epicness of what has gone down today. Amazing day. Big thanks to everyone here. This is not one I'm going to forget in a hurry. I hope you enjoyed coming along there for that experience. That is it for now though. I will catch up with you again very soon. Make sure you're subscribed. Maybe I'll be doing more of this in the not too distant future. Catch up with you guys later. Cheers.